Thumbs up if you're ready to go. Give me a peace sign for Vincent Van Gogh. Show me an okay if you know that the art museum is where we will go. Welcome to the Art at Home Field Trip, starring Mr. Martin. Hi friends, I'm here at the museum and I walked right in. Check it out, this is the entrance. And already I'm seeing shapes. Look at that. So, see what else I can find. I found this Mark Rothko piece that shows a square and a rectangle. Here's another rectangle made by a frame and an electric purple border. And here are some 3D shapes and forms. I see a triangle and rectangles. This piece uses geometric and organic shapes. Oh hey gang, what shape do you see? I see two triangles that make one big triangle. In this next mixed media piece, I see stars and other organic shapes and lines. Speaking of lines, check out the vertical, diagonal, and horizontal lines that make this hyper-realistic factory come to life. Notice the contrast in this architectural model. The organic free-flowing lines made by the trees are juxtaposed against the geometric shapes of the house. Speaking of geometric shapes, notice how this giant bull is divided up into a series of squares using black and white contrast to define the space. Wouldn't you know it, I found my favorite kind of lines, spirals. Hi friends, check out this Keith Haring. Large scale mural. Awesome lines and shapes. It's huge. I see many broken lines, dotted and dashed. I see wavy lines, organic lines, lines that create patterns and implied shapes. Do you see the hands and feet? Speaking of implied shapes... Hey okay, gang, we learned that Monet uses implied shapes. Check out the implied shapes of the lilies. Some of them are full oval, some are just kind of half, but either way, you get to see the implied shapes. Friends! What kind of implied Geometric or organic shapes do you see when you look around? Friends, this is a reminder that art, shapes, and lines are all around. <laughs> Thanks for coming along on this field trip to the Carnegie Museum of Art in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Bye bye